Hey there, Boots Owen here. I found this B-Twin. It's a little chain lock. I don't know what size you'd call it. I haven't got the key. It's sold by Decathlon. Uh, I find them on the side of the road, typically. When you live in the city, you find these things. It's got a little chain inside it. The chain's probably quite easy to cut with the bolt cutters. Let's just give it a go. People have always said, can you do this yourself without... Oh, maybe not. Can you do it yourself without resting it on the ground? So I've got it in against my waist. Oh, I don't think I can. <laughs> I think we'll cut it though this way. Yikes, I don't know if that actually cut or just burst. It didn't really cut. Look at that. It's kind of pressured it apart, so it's a good it's a good hardened chain that, but well, what does that mean? Let's just try it in here as well. For the purposes of science and whatnot. I'll show you the teeth on this. You can see it's actually it's pretty much worn flat. The jaws are well, I've tested quite a few bike locks for the channel. So I don't know if you can see this. I'm putting all my pressure on it. Oh, I'm really bouncing on it here. Yikes. I don't know what's going on there. Nothing, I would say. It's just springing on the plastic. Well, that's positive. Try it there. I'm trying to get it in. in at the jaws. Because the plastic's on it, it's actually keeping it safe in there. But like you can see, it didn't take very long to cut through that chain. So I'd say that's actually an alright chain on my scale of, you know, making it up as I go along. B-twin, decathlon. What would you say that is? 5 mil, 6 mil chain? It's well hardened. Request your comments, leave them below. Thanks for watching. See you later.